My name is Anna Pagnaluna. I'm a United States Air Force veteran. From relatively unknown to beating out four other Republican candidates in the U.S. House District 13 primary, 31-year-old Anna Paulina Luna has come a very long way in a very short time. Someone from my background, from my circumstances, usually doesn't end up in politics. Brit, determination, love of country. My mom had me at 20 years old, walked home from an abortion clinic, and as a result of my father having a drug addiction, there's a lot of involvement of me growing up in the welfare system. She says those experiences helped shape who she is today, as did her time serving in the U.S. Air Force. I joined the military at 19 years old. It was something that I used so that I could pay for schooling, and I can say that I'm very proud to say that I have a STEM degree from the University of West Florida, and I paid for it myself with the help of Uncle Sam. Young, energetic, and social media savvy, Luna is quickly becoming a rising star in the GOP. Her primary victory earning her a complete and total endorsement from the president and a phone call from him. To have him reach down and actually be personally invested in this race, it's a, it's a big deal. This November, however, she faces her toughest challenge yet, a one-on-one -on -one against incumbent Charlie Crist, who has all the name recognition and experience a candidate could want. What I proved in the last election is that it doesn't matter how much you're outspent. If you go to the people and they like you, you know, you could have all the money in the world, but you cannot buy people's trust. Win or lose, she says she's in politics for the long haul and hopes to inspire others, especially especially young women along the way. Regardless of the circumstances that you're born into, you can succeed. You know, there is a certain power in believing in yourself. Josh Cassio, Fox 13 News.